All right, hello again. This is Troy Miller with SpicyJello.com, and I've had some people asking me how to get images into Capture One, and it's for me it's very similar as to a method that I use for Lightroom, and that is drag and drop. Couldn't be easier. Um, if you're in Capture One, you could just go to the the import arrow up here in the top left hand corner, and then you could go to import files, choose the folder you want to import and simply select that and then open them and it, it'll bring into the import dialog box. But what I normally do, and this will actually show you some of my organization, is I create a folder, I drag all the images. Well, here's my years, Greg and Cherish, that's a buddy of mine. And I drag all of his files into that folder and that's where they live forever. That's where they get backed up from, that's where I edit them from, so they never move. So then all I do is I take that folder, I drag it and drop it right on top of Capture One. Import dialog box opens. I don't do any adjustments or anything. And then unlike Lightroom, you don't have to choose whether you do you do one-to-one -one previews or smart previews or anything like that. Capture One will just take care of all that for you in the background. And it's much faster on import. I'm going to show you in real time. So in this folder... 108 images. So there's the lower right hand corner is the import dialog box. There we go. We're done. So now you can see imaging main archived images, 2007 shoots, Greg and Cherish. They're the only two that I've imported from that folder. If I go in there, there they are. They are ready for you to go to work. You can see that they're quickly drawing some previews and you are good to go. Hope that helps.